Hello, this is Adam from VideoWordPressTutorial.com uh, Today I'm going to share with you how to put a WordPress website in maintenance mood. I usually do this when I'm building a new WordPress website because as you all know uh, when you do any customization of your website, changing the themes, the background, anything that you do pretty much people can see it if they, if you go, if they go to your uh, domain even though it's not ready. So you really don't want people to see what you're doing in the back end uh, while you're still you know working the website and it's not ready yet so it's a simple process all we have to do is log into the admin side of our whoops, WordPress website uh, add the simple plugin install it and just activate it and then it will put our website to the public to show as under maintenance or under construction whatever message you want it to show so the first step is go to our website uh, which is uh, video wordpress tutorial.com in our case now as you can see uh, you can view it no problem uh, then I'm gonna go to w dash admin so I can log into the admin side of it I'm gonna put in my username and password and then click login which takes me to the admin side then I'm gonna go to a section called plugin and then I will click on add new and here I usually type in under construction in the search and click search plugin and you will see a lot of plugins that do pretty much the same thing I recommend this one right here it's called under the construction with no space and I usually when I, when I want to choose a plugin I look at the rating and see how they're doing then I go to the plugin details and I see if they have a screenshot. I read a little bit about it here, uh, but I like to see a screenshot to see what the plugin does. So I already know this plugin. It's gonna basically show uh, a black background with some message "Hey" uh, showing here. So I'm, all I have to do is click install now, and it's gonna tell you. Are you sure you wanna install this plugin? Click OK and now uh, it's downloading and now all the the plugin already got downloaded on your wordpress website all you have to do is activate the plugin and then usually plugins most plugins they're going to show up in the settings section of your uh, wordpress website so on here you can see that there's a new tab added it's called under construction you're going to click on it and the plugin is still not yet activated so as you can see it's it's off so we need to make sure that this is on and uh, here you can whitelist certain IPs meaning that uh, uh, that let's say if you want to give certain person access to the website that they can view view it without being blocked without having to log in then you can put in their IP address here uh, and here it gives you display options uh, display the default under construction page display the default under construction page but use custom text or put your own HTML I usually keep it uh, uh, as default but let's say if you want to put something different then you can so let me use the, the default under construction with a custom just for now to see how it looks page name uh, video WordPress tutorial heading uh, under construction body please come back so I'm gonna click save okay so now the options are saved all I have to do is log out now if I go to my WordPress website nothing gonna change as you can see why because I'm logged in already as an admin so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna log out and I'm gonna go back to the website and there you go it shows here basically that the website is under construction please come back soon and this is what everybody will see now whenever you're done with the website all you have to do is log in let's say you're done customizing your website you like it uh, this is exactly how you want it to look and you're ready for it to be live then all you have to do is go to your uh, uh, plugin settings under construction and turn it off 
and then hit save changes. And then after that, you can uninstall this plugin completely from your computer. And all you have to go to is install plugins. And then go deactivate, click on this one where the plugin is. And then select it. Click select delete and apply. Now it's going to ask you, are you sure you want to delete this? You can click yes. And that's it. Now the plugin is completely uh, removed from your website. And even if you log out, you should be able to see your website with no problem. Anybody can see it. So I'm just going to give you an overview of what we did. Uh, we logged into the admin side. We added a plugin called Under Construction. We installed the plugin, did a few uh, customization and activated it, and we were done. Uh, thank you for your time.